your next stage for the happier camper is to get that divider up so Thorne has her own little room and her own little privacy. Yeah, this should be pretty interesting. <laughs> Osmo action clicked on to the bit in the happier camper just above Thorne's bed. Her bed is down here. I am sitting on the toilet. I don't know if you can see that. Um, I just wanted to give you a little update. We picked up this fabulous mini poo powder which is actually not very mini at all. It's kind of huge and there are quite a few scoops in here. And we have our um, disposable, biodegradable liners that we have for the port loo which right now is just being used as a stool. Um, so those are in case of emergencies. Mostly it's for Thorn in case she needs to use the restroom in the middle of the night and she does not have to get up and hike out to the nearest restroom or go in the woods. So what we have here, um, I've just come back from Lowe's and I picked up these happily discounted curtains and command hooks. These ones are supposed to carry four pounds each. Let's hope they genuinely, genuinely do that. So I wanted to put up a rail for Thorn so when she's sleeping late at night, for her, just not so late for us. She has a divider and it doesn't disturb her when we open the door to come in just to go to bed ourselves. So when we camp, we normally have the back end up in the happier camper, but it's really difficult to close that back door quietly um, and it requires quite a lot of force to bring it down from the inside. So we'll close it from the outside really gently and then we come in through the side door here you see because um, we do have our little lanterns on the outside so it'll be just enough ah I wanted to give her her own separate little space so I'm pretty excited about these Alan and Roth discounted curtains See what they look like. Thorn picked these out. Oh, they're beautiful. They should work really nicely. All right, so I've got the camera set up. It was um, hooked on to the wall over, over Thorn's bed. And now it's on its little tripod. So here's my command hook. It's a large window hook and it should stick to the fiberglass really well. So I want this to hang just at the right spot. I think right there. So, open this up. All right, clean with rubbing alcohol. Well, yeah, we're just gonna wipe it down because we're lazy. Remove black liner. That's on this side. All right, I just have to say about the Happier Camper Kitchenette, out of all the tables that go um, in the modular systems, the kitchenette is the most sturdy, which I have appreciated a lot. <laughs> so right now I've got both of my elbows leaning on it while I do this. Okay, remove black liner, apply strip to window. 
Oh, I don't like that. I would have preferred to put it on the hook first. So let me just see where exactly I want the hook. I want it kind of like that. Okay. And uh, hold that down for 30 seconds. Okay, it's been 30 seconds and we've got this uh, little mayfly thinks this is his new home. No, <laughs> off. I don't want you to get stuck. Shoo! Shoo! Off! This is not for you. Okay. A mayfly? Uh, I think it's a mayfly. This little green thing. Okay, now we are going to remove the blue strips. I know this guy came home with us from Mission Viejo, San Juan Capistrano area, and he's decided to make it his home. Don't want to kick him out. It's like our little mascot. Gently hold a hook in place. Now we're going to try this out and our little scoop and there we go. How's it going Thorn? Good. I like I have my own thing. It's called a paper channel. This was my first episode. It's called Two Unknown Consonants. Number one is Zealandia and number two is Central America. Nice. Okay, for the next thing I'm going to do, the next trick, this might not turn out well at all. Um, I have two command hooks, same ones. They should each do four pounds. I've got this old beat up curtain rail that I had been using in the garden as a support for the apple tree. And I've got these curtains that I'm going to give and put up uh, for Thorn. Okay, so the first hook idea did not work for the curtain rail. But I got these other hooks off of Amazon and they're just suction hooks. It came in a pack of four. So they're pretty handy. Obviously the hook doesn't go straight down so I'm going to tie a little um, sort of string rope, thin rope, like garden twine here. And that should hold really well. Got one on each side up here. Back up a little bit. And I also have my other two there to hang some other stuff. It worked! Here is the inside of Princess Thorn's little bedroom. Curtain rail is up. And uh, yeah, it's nice and cool behind the curtain in every which way. It's the other one. So you have it just tied um, that twine to suspend my twig. Okay, let's come out of here so you can see it from the other side. It's not perfect, but it's really cute. Mm-hmm. <laughs>